Rice Hawaii. We got 71 or 71 and a half. Make sure to shop around if you're looking to bet this total because it's all over the place on SBR odds. 17 across the board. The Rainbow Warriors are laying at home. Joe, we'll start off with you. Any opinion? Rice first. Hawaii. Yeah, I like Hawaii here. They're the hot team. I backed them in back-to-back weeks. Love what Cole McDonald is doing in terms of his ability to throw over the top of Rice's secondary. I'm not sold on Rice's ability to go toe-to-toe with Hawaii in this matchup. They can't stretch defenses vertically. They're going to have to run the football. And I like Hawaii to dominate this game. I think they win this game by 28 points or more. I like Hawaii too. Big man, what about you? Yeah, the only thing I'll say is th- this is a much different situation for, for Hawaii than the first two. They're, they're an underdog in the first two. Now they're a double-digit, almost 20-point favorite in the third game. The problem is Rice is no different than their first two opponents. Uh, Rice can't stop anybody, uh, and Hawaii will attack them down the field. Cole McDonald has thrown for almost 900 yards in two games. Um, he's been absolutely terrific. The game plan is go heavy, go hard, and go fast for Hawaii. Rice isn't going to stop that. This would be something I'd keep in mind going forward. Hawaii will be overvalued uh, going into the big uh, or the Mountain West season. Um, I don't know how they'll perform against a good defense. You wonder about that because they've got no pushback with these first three. Um, Am I willing to lay 17? No, uh, but I am willing to go with that. There'll be points. I thought Rice was Joe, and I'd like to get your opinion on this. I thought they were pretty good against Houston. I know they kind of waned off in the second half, but you know, they tested Houston, a pretty good run defense. They were able to move the ball down the field. You know, Tyner was okay. They even brought in the other quarterback as well. I think they can at least move the ball. Hawaii's never been a team that concentrates a ton on defense. I think they can get, to, let's say, 20 points here. But you know, this could be very well 52-20. Uh, I'd like to hear Joe what he thinks about Rice. I mean, I thought offensively they were pretty good. Yeah, I, I was asked about that Rice game against Houston. The fact that they were a home underdog last week, I liked them. I thought they would play well with the long uh, time off in preparation. But I think the one thing that you have to keep an eye out on, they're going to, to Hawaii, number one. It's a road trip. And then the physicality of the four quarters, that Ed Oliver pounding for four quarters from the offensive line. How does that hold up on the road now with the trip? I mean, again, I I was impressed with their ability to move the football on Houston. I'm not sold on Major Apple White in a big spot anyway, but that was a a very solid effort for a week one matchup against a quality opponent in in the Cougars. Again, they they showed an ability from a defensive perspective to run sideline to sideline early, but how does that game affect them as they go on the road to Hawaii would be the one concern because now I think Hawaii is faster than Houston on the perimeter from an offensive perspective how does that make their defense fair in this ball game that's the one concern 